I think Edna may be our Hey, Montgomery. Willie, what's new? Not a damn what thing. What do you have to it? do for Mother Superior now? Not I'm the still scaly finding crumbs stuff. in our bunk. Yeah. Um, the shovel, Lily. We'll never dig up the treasure without a shovel. Um, uh, I don't know where we can find a shovel either. I'd imagine they're kept in the cellar. Now we just need to find a way to get down into the cellar. You can't walk through walls by Maybe any chance, Maybe he'll go down to the uh -huh. cellar by himself. We really have to teach you how to do that one of these days. But first, you should concentrate on the shovel. It has top priority. The only thing I can think of is maybe he uh, goes down and we follow him or something. Oh, I'm still in this. I will learn the controls, I swear it. Oh, maybe he's down in the cellar. No, it was locked. Alright, I know I can't reach anything. I get all that short arms crap. Uh, to the school pond. Alright, I'm gonna go look at, uh, Zippo up there, and, uh, after that, the only thing I can think of to do is to, uh, tweak the Mother Superior. I said, get lost! You're not getting the key. Go do your other chores. Oh, your other chores! So we have, well, we can't do the termites without jelly. Well, let's tweak the uh, Mother Superior. This is a little bit harder than I had anticipated. Oh, we can't do anything because it's done. Too bad. The yeah, fall. we did that. Mother Superior. Oh, we can't even rake now that we're through raking. Okay, well, let's put that up. Let's go to the backyard. And uh, the only clue I have is the other chores. This is a lot touchier than uh, I had anticipated. Hey, uh, really? What's new? Uh, what do you have to do for Mother Superior? Not don't the tell scaly me. butt. I'm still no, 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 crumbs. don't tell me. Not the scaly uh -oh. butt. Are you still worried about the termites? I'd really love to help you. But unfortunately, I don't have any more jelly to lure the little darling someplace else. But when we found the treasure, we can honey. buy ourselves a whole jelly factory. I don't or even better, think... a honey farm. I think honey is much cooler than jelly anyway. It sticks to the bottom, and if we had okay, a honey farm, maybe us. there's still a chance. Yeah, okay, okay, all that, yeah. Uh, I didn't try to grab that uh, beehive out of this floating in the water. This is a whole new genre for me. <gasps> yes, yes, Lily thank you. thought about collecting the honey with her bare hands. But then she remembered her recent scolding at the cafeteria. <laughs> she needed a better plan. Of course she did. <gasps> the string, maybe? Or the brush, the brush. Yes, 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 I feel so smart. Thank you. Okay, did we collect something or what? What have we done? Okay, we have a honey brush. Dynamite, great. I can't believe I said dynamite. Anybody that wants to drop by one of my games and slap me may feel free to. Ah! In my own defense, I was referring to the disgruntled elf wrapped in dynamite in my other game. I was not referring to a show I honestly never did watch. Um, okay, the only thing I can think of is to... Uh... The swing tree was crawling with termites. Why did Mother Superior dislike these cute little animals she's so much? the B word. Okay. Uh... The termites responded very excitedly to the honey. Oh, of course To they lure do. them away, Lily just had to find a good spot to spread it on. Okay, damn it, I wish Edna would talk to me. The well, compost bin that's... was the ideal place there to move you go, the termites to. Lily started right away. 
I should have known there'd only be one place to put it. What I did, and so I'll edit far, that as I look at other places. Well. Maybe a little too well. well uh, the termites course. were now following Lily's spilled honey back hey. into the courtyard. Oh, they got Freeman! A strange sound were drifting towards her from over there. <gasps> the key! Probably the termites celebrating their new home. We can get the key from him. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna edit. I tried to put them everywhere but the compost heap. I was, I tried to put them on the cellar door, and I tried to put them on the tree up here by what's it? But evidently the compost heap, and then they run over here. So, but I'll edit out the other attempts. I tried other. Oh. Had now left for good, but at least the termites had found a new home on the bench. And as if that weren't reason enough to be happy, they had been joined by one of those funny gnomes that Lily sometimes saw around. Okay, uh, I think we just, uh, got MacGuffin. MacGuffin's a reference to the detective in, uh, Lucius. And a MacGuffin, if you look up Alfred Hitchcock MacGuffin or just MacGuffin, it's a plot, it's a thing that's in a story or a movie to advance the plot. And I think these guys advance the plot. And I think, was he Freeman? I hope he was Freeman because he's dead now. Uh, I think the review, because I've only read the review, the review said that Lily sees gnomes. I think that said it was a gnome. Uh, Lily sees gnomes painting pink over bad, unfortunate things that she shouldn't see. And I think it was the question of, is Lily the only one seeing these, or do they really exist? And that's part of what interested me in this story. Okay, we have the key. We have gnomes painting things kind of purpley pink. I don't think, I guess that's a crud shade of magenta. Okay, so we can unlock the uh, cellar. The cellar door could only be opened with the correct key. So that means I have to get it in my hand. And our uh, brush is obviously gone. Freeman had left the cellar key for Lily. How nice of him. <laughs> <laughs> See, I thought I was wasting my time doing that because we knew what it was. Mother Superior had strictly forbidden the children from playing in the cellar. On the other hand, Lily had a task to finish. Oh, yeah, into the cellar. This has really got a loose... It just that you go someplace and pick up stuff is... Oh, I don't think that stop hand means we can't have it. Oh, we can have it. Come on, get let me in my inventory. Lily knew that this device was called an air hammer. <laughs> But she didn't know why anyone would want to hammer air. <laughs> it may be that uh, this kind of rolls once you start. It, I'm just blundered about and Maybe that's where our uh, stove. I'll get to the shovel. I know it's there. What the hey? The stove was black and empty. Just like the mirror that always appeared in Lily's dreams. Oh, you're a dark little girl, aren't you? Uh, I noticed that indie games seem to have a dark side. A shovel! <gasps> That's exactly what yes, Lily Yes, it needed. is! Uh, I've noticed indie games have a dark side. A shovel! That's exactly what Lily needed. Oh, I was going to say, well, pick the GD thing up, please. Okay, stove door. Okay, I'm happy with that. I don't think there's anything else in here. Uh, the finished thought was uh, that indie games seem to have a dark side secret, and they seem to have uh, disturbed children, which is maybe says something about indie game creators. 
geniuses, and I don't know that they're all specifically geniuses, but geniuses don't aren't known for happy childhoods. And if you're a genius, I don't mean to offend you. Well, here's Edna, and she's digging away. We have the shovel. We also have an air hammer. It's kind of tempting. Lily knew that this device was called uh, an air hammer. But she didn't we know why anyone would want to hammer air. Okay, so let's go with the shovel. So do we just dig here and see what happens? Yay! Hey, you found a shovel! Yes, oh, I Lily, did. you're the best. Of course Let's I am. Let's not waste any time and dig up the treasure. I really wondered what the hell's in here. Edna and Lily began digging out what they thought was a treasure chest. That's quite a treasure chest. It looks like it might have belonged to some space pirates once. Mm -hmm. So what? They were space pirates from World War II. Who cares? What's more important is that they left us their treasure. Come on, let's open it. I'm so excited. Uh-oh. I'm thinking bomb. <laughs> oh. oh, aerial bomb. Well, yeah, I guess I am thinking bomb here. Okay, we're on an aerial bomb. I had to do a little sound tweak. I'm this has to be louder than I'm used to. So anyway, let me not interrupt the flow too much. Uh, <laughs> Edna's, uh, yeah, World War II pirates. Okay. Uh, well, the hand stops us from doing anything stupid, hopefully. <laughs> That's not going to work. Once again, more proof that the bad reputation raw violence has is completely undeserved. Here, we certainly won't get far without it. Uh-oh, so you're a uh, proof. A real us. treasure chest. It was hard to tell, but Lily was actually speechless. Okay, I don't know now. We have, we have... Okay, we can't pick it up. So Come what on, do let's do open it. Now? I'm so excited. That oh. reputation raw violence has is completely undeserved. Here, we certainly won't get far without it. Oh, no. I suppose you're all there before me. <laughs> this is just a, a real psychological need not to do this. <laughs> and this calling for raw violence. Okay. Great! Now the device should have enough oomph to open the treasure chest. What's the matter? What are you waiting for? Don't you know how to use it? Uh-uh. Ah, uh, don't worry. We'll find something else. Oh, okay. So that's a no. Well... Great! Now the no. device should have oh, enough no. oomph to open the treasure chest. What's the matter? What are you waiting for? Don't you know how to use it? Uh-uh. Uh. Ah, don't know. worry. We'll find something else. Actually, I do know how to use it. I was just wondering how how absorbent my panties are <laughs> for when I pee them. <laughs> okay, I think we can just right-click and get rid of that. Uh, well, we don't have anything else yet. So, I think that we've done our chores. <laughs> So I think we can get in the convent. I don't think Edna has anything else for us at this point. Well, darn it, go to the school pond. <laughs> hey, Freeman. Still dead, buddy. <laughs> okay, I think off to the convent. Lily wasn't allowed into the convent until the gardening had been done. Hopefully it wouldn't start hailing again. Okay. So we're stuck. We need something with more power than an air hammer. I really was counting on that to be the way to go. So are there explosives down here or what? Ah, there's a can of food. Lily got along great with Doris, the lunch lady. That's why she knew Doris would start throwing knives if anyone messed up her pantry. <laughs> Okay, Digested so. Digested grass, rat, pigeon, 
Lily assumed these cans were meant for the cafeteria. Oh, yeah, I'd say so too. I gotta do that one more time. Digested grass, rat, pigeon. Lily assumed these cans were meant for the cafeteria. <laughs> So we, uh, this is just not a good place for little children. Okay. So the air hammer is not enough. What am I missing? Today was Lily's lucky day. She hadn't found so many new toys in a very long time. Oh, I have to get that out of my hand. Oh, there we go. You did it. Hmm. So what's that fun. supposed to be? Those space pirates must have led a pretty miserable life if this was their most precious treasure. Well, at least we have a fabulous chest, and I already have an idea what we can do with it. We'll bury our own treasure. Do you have anything on you? Hmm. Uh-uh. Some wool from embroidery class? Oh, wow, yeah. that's perfect. Our friendship ribbon, the string that ties us both together, so to speak. Come on, put it in there. Now we just have to bury the chest again and... Lily! Where did the brush disappear to now? Lily! That's Mother Superior. What does she want now? We should check before she explodes. <laughs> be careful, you know? <laughs> we should check before she explodes. <gasps> That took much too long for my liking. Is everyone finally here? Freeman is missing, Mother Superior. <laughs> Say nothing more! Your lack of discipline has reached a level that I can no longer tolerate. From now on, all games on the convent grounds are forbidden. And until further notice, there will be no more dessert, and bedtime will be moved up by an hour. And in case you're wondering, it is the bad behavior of one specific student that has led me to take these measures. That would be me. In my helplessness, I even decided to call on an expert for help. He's a renowned psychologist who will restore discipline and order here in the convent. Poor Lily. What a fortuitous The examination will take place this evening. The doctor will drive the mischief out of you once and for all. And I can guarantee this much. It won't be a pleasant experience. So is it. A psychological examination? Oh, Lily. I'm sure this is all about me. Oh, I desperately no. need a plan. Meet me near the beds. I'll need your help. Oh, Edna? We have to save Edna. You have the rest of the day off to think about what you've done wrong. I'd better not hear that you've used the time to create more mischief and... Lily, I'm expecting you in my office. Now! I'm very disappointed in you, Lily. Can you ever do anything right? Ugh. Not another word. Your constant excuses just make me even angrier. Mm. And now just don't stand around like an idiot. Well, 